Days after Google's startling demonstration of their very human-like duplex AI speech tech, the responses and concerns are rippling through the technosphere and beyond. Reactions have ranged from wonder and amazement to horror, according to one tech critic. It's May 11th and questions about the use and possible abuse of duplex, which places AI very close to passing the Turing test in our opinion, are building quickly. Should people be warned they are about to talk to a robot? Should the voice sound purposefully synthetic, like the device Stephen Hawking used? All good questions and tough ones. According to Bloomberg, ethical concerns and business opportunities are going to clash over this tech, which is still in development at Google. Duplex is not an app or program available to the public. Yet. But eventually, you can bet it will be. And down the road, people are wondering what else Duplex might be too human at. Writing books singing opera, very convincing political robocalls. A bridge has been crossed, that's for sure, but what kind of land we're in now isn't fully known, and it's all thanks to a phone call to a hair salon. Hit the links below for more info on the growing duplex debate. More Google news now. Tech leaker Evan Blass, who has a solid track record of leaky things, is saying Google is likely to take aim at Apple, once again, with a new smartwatch. Right now, Apple is dominating the segment, and in truth, the entire watch industry as a whole. And of course, Google would like a piece of that action. Blass says a reliable source tells him a Pixel-branded watch is in the works, with a fall reveal at a Google hardware event. And knowing Google, there will likely be a spread of models tailored for certain activities. Sports, leisure, maybe even kids. There are no specifics yet on watch features, prices, and so on, but it would make sense that Google would want in on the category, even if it's not the hottest segment going right now. Because like we've said before, eventually pretty much anyone wearing a watch will be wearing a smartwatch. You'll see. Yep. They're back, even though they never really went away. Of course, that's a Boston Dynamics robot going for a leisurely jog in your neighborhood, looking out for criminals, doing some log hopping, and just getting some exercise. The only thing missing? A robot dog. Oh, there he is. Good boy, please don't kill me. The jog bot, it's an upgraded Atlas humanoid model, continues Boston's unbroken streak of creeping us the hell out while simultaneously fascinating us with the potential of these pre-Terminator machines. You know, just put some skin and simple muscles on it, add Google Duplex, and boom, it's got your job. Welcome to the future. Okay, that's all for today. Thanks for tuning in. Of course, get the rest of the day's news at digitaltrends.com on our Facebook page and YouTube channel and tune in to our movie and entertainment podcast Between the Streams live at 2 p.m. Pacific today. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week.